Very, very, very special guest is somebody so important to us as Asian Americans in this great country of ours. Um, do you remember the show Cheers? Right? Do you remember the guy that always hailed because everybody loved him in the bar, Norm? Okay, this is your former Secretary of Commerce under the Clinton administration, the former Secretary of Transportation under the George W. Bush administration, your friend from the great Northern California area of San Jose, your friend and mine, I'm so glad to welcome him. Everybody give him a shout out to Norm Mineta. Thank you, Tamlin. One thing about Tamlin, she never forgets where she's from. She comes back and involves herself in every community event, and she is just terrific about that. So, Tamlin, we thank you very, very much for your participation. I also want to thank uh, the chancellor of this great university. You know, I'm, I went to that other little school up north uh, called um, UC Berkeley, I guess it is. Go Bears! But I'll tell you, you folks here at UC Irvine have a terrific chancellor in Michael Drake. And Michael, I want to thank you very much for not only your enthusiastic support of this APIA vote town hall being held, held here at Irvine, but you know it's reflected with everybody down the staff here who's been so great in cooperating with all of us who are involved in APIA vote. So thank you for your leadership and for your participation in making this so uh, successful here at UC Irvine. Now, you've heard the expression, it's important to be at the table. And so through elected officials, and through community participation, we are able to gain visibility and political clout. And that is very, very important. And that's why this town hall is celebrating our achievements and our contributions all throughout the country. It's also about our role in the electoral process. And this year, more than ever, our voices and our votes will be even more important. All of you know how close the votes are, whether it's total votes, delegate count, superdelegates, all of these numbers are so close. And so part of this process is also about making sure that our community takes part in the presidential elections and that we are looked to as part of the important process of making sure that the system works. Now, we felt that it was imperative for the candidates to not only meet members of the community here in this hall, but also for the thousands of people who are watching online across the country. Now, because of the tight race of the remaining primaries, uh, we've had uh, the candidates uh, not able to be here in person, but we will hear from all of them. So again, they will be answering questions that have been posed by members of our community. And it is important that these candidates work and partner with our community on issues that we all care about. And all of you know what they are, things like affordable housing, care, quality health care, immigration, civil rights, civil liberties, and the list goes on and on. And as I stand here, as, just as Chancellor Drake was amazed earlier today at looking at people across the spectrum in this room and the collective potential to be able to work together and create this kind of a movement in the country today is really heartwarming. This is the first one, API town hall vote. It is the first town hall meeting, but it is an important, important first start for our beginning as we are hosted here at UC Irvine. So again, between now and November, 
There's a, there are a lot of events going on, so we need you to be involved in all of those races across the country. So don't uh, hold back. Join in with the candidate of your choice and make sure that you register your friends, family, whomever, neighbors, and make sure that you get them out to vote in November as well. So again, thanks to all of you for taking time from your own very busy schedules to be here today to participate uh, in this very, very important beginning of what we will see as annual town hall meetings put on by APIA vote. Again, to UC Irvine, to Chancellor Drake, to President uh, Dines of the UC system, to everyone involved in making this a success. Thanks a million, and for me, I'll have to say, go Bears!